And uh, you brought something up, which I'd, I'd really like to go, go into, and you spoke about action. I mean, it's like making something happen. Uh, I've already interviewed two people who brought you up in conversation. And um, I think one of the, the 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 striking things about you and I, 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 agree, I, I agree fully. I mean, it, you, you, you've inspired me on this level as well. We've worked together. Um, you know, we're friends. We've known each other for a long time. Is um, is how active you are. You um, you have an ability to um, to mo to mobilize your ideas and to um, experiment and tackle things. I remember working with you on set. Um, there was a shower, and you were you wouldn't let it go. You were <laughs> lighting it from all different angles, and you were considering, considering, considering. And um, you know the, the 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 final product was was quite something. You know, uh, do you want to speak to that? Uh, what motivates you? What drives you into action like that? Um, I think I've got potentially, I mean, not being diagnosed or anything, but maybe like slight ADHD or I have it or something, but I, I tend to zoom into a, a idea or focus on something. And although I can get easily distracted, but when I really focus on something that I really want to do or emotionally are hooked onto or a brief I have to follow, I kind of, everything else falls away. Um, it's like a super focus thing. Like sometimes, you know, like it's almost like the whole world can come to end behind me, but I cannot let go. It's like a, do a, a dog with a bone. I cannot pull myself away from this thing until I fixed it. So it's almost, it's obsessive in a way that, yeah, it's, there's a problem I need to solve it will be very difficult for me to just leave it and go, okay, I'll get back to this. And obviously sometimes I need to because it's pointless and I'll drive everybody and myself insane. Um, but it's just, it is a bit of like an obsessive. I need to solve this problem or I'm not happy with the shot yet and I will not easily move on until I'm happy with it. And other people, even my clients might go like, we're happy, you can move on. And I'm like, it's not there yet. <laughs> <laughs> it needs to I know I know what I'm after. I'm not gonna let go. So yeah, I have to pull away. So I don't know what motivates me. It's probably just the way my brain works. Um that just I get I there's so much chaos and my mind also in in the world and stuff, but then I kind of zoom into something and I'm I'm there. I just like <laughs> I have to solve that thing. <laughs> That's where the, it makes me think of where the scientist in you comes out with your experimentation and and your desire to just to solve things. Well, maybe it's like a mad scientist because I'll be like, ah, I have to do this thing. Yes, it's that. I think it's personality or something. I don't know. And your 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 um your extreme focus and uh, desire to 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 resolve issues. As I said before, it's been quite inspirational to the people that you've worked with, and um, and and your energy is a similar is another thing that has um, sort of been spoken about um, uh, by other people in a good way. You know how but... how motivating you are, and how you know you have a lot of energy. You generate a lot of energy, and um, energy in in focus, focused on the task at hand. And um, you know how does that? Um, how how? Do, uh, actually, what I wanted to say was that energy is 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 quite inspiring, and you 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 you're quite generous with that energy in terms of mentoring other artists, um, uh, you know, sharing with other artists, getting into artistic conversation. And um, you spoke about how no two artists can make the same work. You have that kind of philosophy. Would you like to speak? Mm. Yeah, I think it's um, very important for us to speak to each other and to communicate and support each other. And um, yeah, I think it's just passion. For me, a lot of my energy, I suppose, come from feeling very passionate about what I do and I generally do get a lot of enjoyment out of that problem solving um, thing because it's it's so challenging and it's so magical that we can 
with so little and with other people collaborate or on our own and create something out of nothing, like something that you have in your mind and make visual something that can have impact or not, but that can become a manifestation of that.